Good morning. It's day two here in Pattaya. Uh, we are going to go ahead and spend the day exploring Pattaya surroundings. We're gonna check out um, a couple of cool locations. Mm -hmm. Day three, actually. Oh yeah, day three. Anyway, day three. sorry. Right. Um, so first, we're gonna go to the Sanctuary of True. So just hang tight, sit back, and just watch our journey there. We made it to the Sanctuary of Truth. Now we're just gonna go get a park our bikes over here. Let's go buy some tickets. Okay guys, so we just bought our ticket and I guess apparently because of COVID, you have to do a tour. Yeah, I guess it's their way of getting some revenue in. Um, it's 500 baht per person. So we ended up paying a thousand baht, which averages around like 20, 25 dollars. Um, Yes. Yeah, it was a little bit more pricey than we thought. I guess we didn't do any research on looking that up. Uh, they do have other options there. They were kind of rushing us to get out of there. So yeah. we didn't get to film like the attractions they have, um, which mind you, like a speedboat, um, elephant trekking, no. Um, something else, there's a few other things, but not available because of COVID of course. But yeah, they, it was interesting. And again, because you're coming to a temple, make sure you have something to wrap around your legs. They, yeah, we brought the wrong bag that had our serapes in it. So it looks like we're gonna be buying something to wear while we're inside. The tours go by the hour. So make sure you get here on time, if not early to book your spot. It's 20 people per tour right now. There might be some people ahead of us, we haven't seen any, but at the moment it's just two of us for the 9 a.m. tour. So I think we made it to the spot, but holy cannoli, you guys. Somebody cop. Oh my goodness. That is the most breathtaking temple hybrid I have ever seen in my entire life. I have chills. And again, like we mentioned in our previous video, they have a little section here where you can rent um, either pants or a wrap, or you can buy them. Um, $200 deposit to rent. But again, guys, this is massive. We didn't expect it to be this big. Our museum, Sanctuary of Truth. It was built 1981, not too old, 40, yeah. 40, 42 years old. It's still under construction until today, not uh. finished yet. You can see also the five picture. We took a picture from the, the higher top. The first, a man holding the lotus present strong intention to be good person and bring peace to our own society. Second, a woman holding the book represent learning the truth of life from the past so that we recognize no matter what we are worthy from everyone deserves the same treat and the same respect we are human mm. beings third a man holding the elderly by hands represent the generosity toward to others fourth a woman holding the rise of pity represent peace can start to ourselves first and then we may become the role model to show each other and influence to them becoming a good people with a good intention. The last one, the topmost, the goddess on the horse with the flower in her hands, the symbol of success from the four collectors, which is the life purpose, and this is the key component to bring the world peace. So now the time to explore. Yes. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Thank and also you. when you go down, we have the helmet for you under construction. Perfect. Thank you. Okay. 
สวัสดีครับ Okay, so now you can join me for the information. Yes. So, do you want to join with the information or just look and take photos? No, we all the information is yeah. the best. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Okay, yeah. So That'd be great. Thank you. What's your name? Da. 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 Nice to meet you, Da. Pleasure to meet you, Da. I'm Jose. Da. 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 And Will. Well, nice okay. to meet you. Easy to guess. Nice to meet you. Thank Easy you. Easy to remember, na? No? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Monday, they got things like chisel and the hammer like that. Wow. Like that. They made a small hole. They use that brain machine. Okay. Brain yes. machine to the, you know, a small hole to the easy to cut out like that. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Wow. They don't want to use. They don't want to use nails or some sacro because near the sea, they worry about to rust. The rust. That's why they yep. have they should to use wooden being wooden drain for everywhere. This building is uh, the Sanctuary of Turtle Museum. Uh, construction started in 1981, so right now, uh, 40 years already. Now, but they're not yet complete state construction. When they complete, yes, and no one knows exactly about that. Yes, yes. Okay. It's um, it's hard to describe what I'm feeling right now. That's a great. The Sanctuary of Truth was built as an appreciation for all philosophies, art, culture, and faith that influence the Southeast Asian architecture. It is beautifully crafted in all wood and symbolizes unity and peace among all walks of life. Inside the sanctuary, we will learn more about the seven truths and see why it's called Thailand's most beautiful wooden structure. All society has good and bad are mixed together. Yes, but the finally good can win today. Oh, the builder, you guys. You can literally spend an entire day and not see every little thing. It's impossible. Oh my goodness. It yes. has four directions, four physics. This represents about sublime state of our mind, or okay. the basis law of human being. The first one, kindness. Kindness, yes. we should be kind to another one, another life, right? Correct. And then number two, compassion, a feeling on other substance, right? And then number three is a, a rejoicing in other good fortune. Rejoice. Don't be jealous to the other people. We should be glad, we should be happy for the other happy life. And then number four is equanimity. Like the four feet, like four feet. I love that. This is breathtaking thing I've ever seen. It's a wave. Water wave is a moving away from the sanctuary of truth. So there has a one to show you about aquatic creatures are represent for ourselves. Right now we are swimming against the water. In the social trend or the material wave. Ah. Yes, a very difficult time. Huh? Yeah. And now it's a, we are swimming against the social trend to find the true meaning of our life inside the sanctuary of truth. Wow. You understand here, right? Yes, it's, okay. it's deep. Yeah, yeah. The yeah goosebumps. Yeah. <laughs> human equality also no matter how rich you are where you are from and the religion you believe everyone deserves same tree same respect because all we are saying we show in by the grateful elements wind fire water and the earth everybody composed with these four elements uh.
our life cycle are in the nature, beginning to the end. No matter how rich you are, or the rich or poor, beauty or not, everyone are, you know, born in the nature and we grow in the nature. After that, when we die, we go back to the nature, beginning. Yes, our lives are empty days. We say like that. Because when we born, we have nothing. Right? right? Same right. When, when we die, die. we can take nothing again. Symbolize it like that. Okay, when we come and when we out, we have nothing. But just one. How did we live in our life and how did we do in our life for ourselves and for the other and for the society? Good or bad? Improve or just trying to the society? As you guys can see in this video, the Sanctuary Truth is massive. There's a story behind each and every piece. Jose and I were definitely thankful to have Da along the journey to help explain each and everything we saw. All right, we just finished the tour, and um, from my end, that was the most moving tour experience I've ever had in my life. I'm speechless. I'm somebody that's very into whether I'm really, I'm not a religious person, but I'm very spiritual, and I love cathedrals and I love all of that. This is by far the most beautiful, inspiring place I've ever been. I mean, I still have goosebumps. They have not went <laughs> away. Tears were shed, shed. from both ends, um, just from hearing uh, the truths that we should all live by. And believe it or not, you're living them right now. This is just breathtaking. And to be surrounded by the sea. So because we're children, we love goats. I they like little miniature. Mm -mm, not you though. I've seen you in movies. Hey guys, what are you guys up to today? Poop guys, eat it. Do you think we have food? Um, 